Hello everyone, this is Gali and this is a new episode of Artist Feature. Today we're going to see Tamber Elaf or Devin L. Kurtz, I think. She is very young and very talented and I will show you why. This is her gallery in DeviantArt, but I want to show you first what she did at the beginning. She's always been awesome, but you will see the improvement over the years and maybe get some inspiration and a will to draw better. I certainly did. So, as you can see, far away, she still draws really well. It's mainly portraits and animals, but you'll see what I mean when I say she improved. Although this is really good, and this one looks like my cat. And I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Okay. So, she started with, uh, I think... A little lion or something with colors on its body like a stained glass window I'm trying to find it but ah, here it is so I don't know the name I didn't read it but I do like the style it's very original and I love stained glass windows so this style is really nice she might be able to say the name I think it's called ink So, well, we're far down your gallery now. I will show you the difference. So I will open that one first. And maybe open one of the pages of her comic if I find one. Oh, looks so cute. So, I the first time I saw her work was with this tiny creature here. And it's really nice, like, looking at this strange, whimsical style. And I never seen any animal like this. As you can see in the reflection, he has a different body, maybe like a like the normal, normal natural looking form, like a leopard maybe. I don't know, but it's adorable. I don't know if it's a lion or a leopard or something else, but it's really cute. So this is the start of one of her comics. So I hope you will check it out. And I will show you like this. This is a very nice drawing. So what I want you to see is that this was made in 2011. So remember this one. And now, dun dun dun. Well, this is self-explanatory. When you look at the other drawings, you kind of notice how much she improved. Look, look how pretty. So maybe this one. I don't know. She draws pets. Like, look at this. So you can see she learned how to draw. Um, fur really well and expressions and poses and backgrounds pretty much every animal She now draws backgrounds as well and Beautiful beautiful feline creatures with nature on their faces What I love about her work is the colors the the feeling that this could be real that you could find this person and this animal somewhere in the forest It's just so so wonderful I love her contrasts, the light, and the process because she shows how she does it, I think, in Instagram. I like that she's not afraid of using perspective or using humans or colors. Like, she, she goes beyond what she did before and evokes emotions. As you can see, like, she shows speed paints, animal paintings. Her own mossy lions, which I love. Cats, Vaporeon, Pokemon, you name it. I love her work with the, the colors, the textures, the expressions of her creatures. Every, everyone, this looks like my cat as well. Mishka. Oh, this is Mishka for me. <laughs> and this one is Maxima, my cat. They're so cute. So... Not only can she draw that, she drew this wonderful, adorable box of Disney creatures. So cute. So yeah, I encourage you to check her work. Because she has all shaded work, painterly work, cute and adorable creatures. And that was just a pigeon that landed and my cats attacked it. So if you heard a big sound, it was a poor bird crashing against my window. Back to the video. So... Now we can see she also draws dragons, which I love, and backgrounds, and you name it. 
She does it. And I do believe she's young. And well, she has tutorials. I believe it's very, very worth it to invest in one of these because she shows you as well how to draw the muscles and the skulls and it's really wonderful, so check it out. And I don't know if she has the brushes, but maybe she does. Yes, she does. The brushes I got from her, they change color as you paint. It's very interesting. And she also has how to, um, sorry, she, pa she draws your creatures maybe or tutorials. I think she stopped doing that, the tutorial or the commission on drawing pets, but I hope she opens it again. So please check her out. Her name is Tamburella. Being a wonderful inspiration for many people here. And I hope she keeps on being because she's really awesome. So thank you for watching guys. We'll see you in another artist feature or tutorial. Bye bye.